Hello, I'm Zardis, and let's play Planet Zoo. Welcome back to my uh, career mode series. This will be the third part in the Myers Rainforest Conservation Project and episode 49. And look at that, we already have a bin that's been knocked over. Well, all these people. We have, I think we have a security card. But let's go ahead and come in here and we're going to get a security camera here. And that might make a little bit of a difference. Put this like right here in the corner. And then we'll put another one over here. So hopefully we have that coverage. Do we have security and crime? Yeah, that area is covered. So most of the bins will be that we can watch that. Okay, but today, what I want to do is we, let's see, we achieved bronze last time. The next biggest thing we want to work on is having more animals. So let's go ahead to the animal market and see what we can do. Tapirs, there's a lot of tapirs. I think that probably makes the most sense. I mean, we have a lot to choose from. Bingos, grizzlies, uh, that might be good too. Although they need colder temperatures than I think we have. Saltwater crocodile, I wonder if we could get that down near, down here in the bottom. We probably would want it to be a bit deeper in here. What's this alert? low welfare for the snow leopard yeah that's because we are working on uh that research oh look at that we have finished pause uh pause that's a different button in this game so we want to get lynn bailey on okapis now because we should be able to come over here to the snow leopards and give them better enrichment habitat Species Snow Leopard. Okay, so now they can have frozen blood pumpkin. That's pretty much it. Oh, and a block of ice. Let's give them that. And a frozen blood pumpkin. Oh, we'll keep that over here as well. Yeah, I think that'll be fine. So what do they have now? They have low social stress. They're trying to hide. Hmm. Okay. So they they need more space to hide. Let's get some uh, nature in here. They were, what are they from? Asia Taiga. Taiga. Asia. Let's get a few. Actually, I wonder. Could get some rocks in here. Here, that should make it a bit easier. And what I want to do then is we're going to come in here and we're going to grab a bunch of these. duplicate them over to this side so now if they want to hide they have plenty of space down in here uh, but let's go ahead and get another one of these it's because we don't have that on the ground there yeah I mean they could come in here and nobody would be able to see them there. So that'll be good. Let's go ahead and unpause. And now, I mean, they're eating their food. That's gonna have them out in front here, but we could probably make it a little bit harder to see them there. We don't want Scott's Pine because that will, uh, they could climb.
climb on that, I think. Yeah, let's check in here. I want to see animal welfare. No, that's not what I want. Habitat. Traversable area. Yes, you. Yeah, so they actually, they can't climb on that. So let's get a tree down in there. And that should give them a little bit more privacy too. I don't like making it hard for people to see them, but I think it, it in this case, for their welfare, it is important. So we'll add just a little bit in there. Now, back to the animals. I don't think I want to do the saltwater crocodile there after all. Okay, that's all we have though. These two pages. So I think what we'll do next is we'll go with the tapirs. So what do you need? You need grade two, 3.3 3 feet, not a ton of space. And just a couple of them. So that will be pretty easy. And I think we'll put the tapirs over here. We have this building up here. Lots of toxic waste in here too. One, okay, just remove this whole bush, I guess. Or we could use this somehow, but I kind of want to just get rid of the whole building. But we're going to extend the path out this way. Or maybe we go down the hill now. Yeah, I mean, I think what we're going to end up doing is we'll get a gondola ride that goes up this way. I think that'll be the best spot for that. So let's work over in here next. Okay, so we want... What was that? Braid 2. Okay, so more... Another wooden path. Or wooden log. And this one... I think we can come in here and we can get multiple habitats back over here. So bring this over like this. That will be the tap piers. Then we'll get a gate back in here. It's going to have to be a separate work zone, I think. Money is down. Why is money down? Oh, because we're building now. Those rocks must have been expensive, man. No, they weren't. Maybe the barrier was. Okay, but anyway, we're going to come in here and have this one, I believe. And we're going to continue this way with the path right on the edge. But I also want to bring one off like this and go down. Ah, the inspector's report is ready. Let's see. We had five star, yeah, we're doing pretty good. We've got a four star report there. And then this will come up in here. Let's move this rock. It's a tropical rock. Oh, mechanic research complete. Okay, we'll get you on another type of theme move this rock 
not that way. Oh, good. It's getting to be daytime again. We'll be able to see better. So this path comes all the way back here. And then we will switch to a staff path here. And that can go in that way. And then we'll get another one. Comes back like that. So now here we want a keeper hut. Then we want a staff room back here as well. And probably a workshop. Although we, I don't think we quite need that. We will need power and water. Uh, water we don't need, but power. Yeah, let's get a power thing. Facilities. transformer right back in here okay so what does that do for power gives us power over here very good okay and we can go ahead and adopt some tapirs now and what do we want we want how many points we have 687 points right now so we could do this one. It's a female. Or right, that was a male. Let's get a female as well. I'm going to have two. Uh, this one is not pump, but it has good fertility. Okay. We'll do that one. And both of you can go right to quarantine. And we can start getting some stuff in here. Uh, species. Now we want Beard's Tap here and not the Snow Leopard. You get a food trough over here. We'll get Bob's Enrichment down here. And we need a shelter. There we go. They can have shelter. They can have a water thing here. Let's go ahead and smooth the terrain out here a little bit. That works. Okay, so that goes in there. Then we can get... I guess that's about all we can do here. What temperature do they want? Birds tap here, 61 to 108. So we should be fine with temperature in there, but we do want to come in here. And this is all going to be glass. Very good. And we need more of these as well. Get one here. here and here then let's come in and get some educational boards one two three and a fourth one over here we don't have an animal in here yet. Okay, uh, quarantine passed. Very good. Both of you can be moved over to the tap here exhibit. Why can't I zoom out here? What? There we go. Okay, that was weird. You're going to come over here to Habitat 3, which is going to be renamed Very good. So you're moving in there. 
Snow Leopard, you have low welfare again? Temperature, why, why did you leave your temperature area? Let's be able to duplicate this and get another one. Right there. Just to make it a little bit better for them. Okay. So now, that research complete. That should be the we'll copy. I'm still working on that. Okay. That'll be good. We should get the tap here in here pretty soon. Oh, we need more staff here. We need to set up a new work zone. And I don't know what we'll call this. We'll just leave it as word zone two. And we want to come in here. We'll get a caretaker, a keeper, and a mechanic for here. Oh, we need our vet should just be a rolling vet now. And we can come in here now and word zones. Unassigned staff. One, two, three, four. This guy. Assigned to word zone two. Very good. Okay, you're like running way over there. What do you need? You need better terrain. You need more short grass. And then up here. You need less sand. You need more soil. Get heavy soil down here. We'll do light soil up here. And then you need more long grass as well. There, terrain is good. You need navigable swimming area. Hmm. Okay, so we'll have to work about that, man. That is a pain. Because that means we also need to get a water treatment thing. Let's come in here and we will get water treatment over here. And then we could come in extra space do they have? Okay. I'm gonna need to move this box. Let's put that over here. And I actually want this to be heavy soil. That should go in like that, and then we should be able to just come in with water right away. And does that qualify as plenty of swimming area? Yeah, good. So they can come down here and go swimming. It should be treated water now, and we want foliage. Where are you from? You are from South America. Uh, let's do tropical. Nature, continent. South America, tropical. Trees, Brazil nut. Okay, so that gives them much better coverage. They should be happy now. Uh, let's see, habitat. Uh, everything is good except enrichment, which is exactly where we expect it to be. And now we've got these. We can get education boards on, or like turn these on. We'll copy. Tap here. Tap here. 
tap here and tap here okay so and now we're all set we can get at least one more habitat over here too and i'm pretty happy with that unfortunately it is nighttime let's speed this up again we can't really see it all that well Spectre arriving in three months how are the snow leopards doing now they are all hiding in here which is just fine that research complete uh, let's go ahead and slow this back down and vet research pretty good got another old copy thing keep going on that and just while we're at it real quick let's see Turn that although tap here anything for enrichment that we could get a sprinkler in there that must be something we can put in here too Okay, turn them off and come down here to oh, copy. Yeah, that's the only enrichment we have for them right now, but that already begins to improve that a little bit. So that'll be good. And uh, yeah, let's finish speeding this up so we get a good light, especially so I can take screenshots. Uh, people are not happy, and that is primarily hunger, thirst and education is lacking so maybe next time we'll work a little bit more on education we have a couple of these education boards but for the most part they are not oh here we can get this going it's been vandalized okay but anyway that's it uh mechanic research let's get that on one more theme setting Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will catch you next time. Take care.